New Mexico State got their money's worth and then some in their 31 10 victory on the plains. Auburn could not find their rhythm against an Aggies team that both outcoached them and outplayed them. A, a great uh, something I hope sits in the crawl of our stomach and makes us sick and and gives us a reminder for future that you have to earn your right to win a football game every single time you're out. Leading up to the game, Coach Freeze emphasized how momentum is an everyday thing and you have to work to keep that. Eugene Asante touched on how the team got a little too comfortable after a big win against Arkansas last weekend. Uh, I just think guys are, and I'm, I'm including myself in this whole thing, um, got comfortable. Um, went to Arkansas and played a really good game and maybe bought into the praise and the outside noise and didn't go out there and continue to remain humble. Myself included, I felt that within myself too. Leader on the team, Peyton Thorne, had a message for the fans after saying that as a team, they need to be more critical of themselves. Um, we appreciate the support again, coming out again. Uh, looked like a pretty full stadium at the start. Uh, and just yeah. apologize for our effort today. And, you know, our, yeah, our execution right. wasn't good enough tonight. Uh, we just weren't good enough tonight, and that's plain and simple. And uh, we got to get better. You know, we can't we can't let that happen. With next week's Iron Bowl marking the 10 year anniversary of the kick six, both Auburn and Alabama fans are wondering how this embarrassing loss sets up the rivalry week classic. Emily Grace McCorder for the next round.